This is Mr. Everything, and I'm coming at you with some IL-2 Sturmovic Flying Circus. We're going to go ahead and continue on with our Spring Offensive Campaign. Uh, let's go ahead and get into that. Uh, we have Mission 4, Offensive Patrol. Uh, that's where I take a flight lead of five camels, and we also have a group of three flying high cover for us. Uh, we fly across the border. We look for some two-seaters. The reason why I know that is because I played it like 30 minutes ago and my computer decided to restart right in the middle of the stream. And so the recording that I had already recorded was discarded. Okay, so we're going to take off from Bertangles, go by Almens and the Villers, and then we're going to fly a patrol over here by the river. And then once we are satisfied, we'll fly home. Uh, in the camel setup, I got to have the enlarged windows. I'm blind as a bat, so I need that. And I think I'm going to bring my, it, my convergence. I don't even know why that matters because my guns are so close together. Uh, having a convergence... Uh, I think like 500 would be better because that means the guns are, fl are firing straight forward. Uh, actually, that would mean they're firing straight forward. If I convert it into 100 meters, that means there's a crisscross at 100 meters. So at 200 meters, they would be as wide as the guns. At 300 meters, they would be as wide as double the guns. 400 meters, the shots would be super wide. So I'm thinking, and I'm going to engage people close anyway. Uh, 400 meters. That way it's not, it doesn't crisscross to the negative until 800 meters. All right, I'll see you on the airfield. All right, there we go. We are on the airfield. Let's go ahead and get this engine started. There should be five of us and three extras. Getting my track IR all squared away. Looks like my Control surfaces are working. Oh, I didn't know it had an upper and a lower aileron. That's cool. Those guys don't start their engine until we're pretty much in the air. Okay, these guys look like they're good to go. Let's get this show on the road. I'm going to dig my tail in. Right? I'm going to throttle up to... To about 50%. And then I'm going to start to accelerate with my tail dug in. Using it kind of as a brake. And then I'm going to let go. No brake. Let go of the brake. See? Nose it forward a little bit. Get my tail off the ground. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Sorry guys, I almost ran into you guys. <laughs> we got some we got some anti-aircraft guns sitting over there waiting to defend the air base. And then the rest of the guys are taking off. Okay, excellent. I don't know who those guys are. It doesn't really bother me. I'm just going to gain a little altitude here. Let's go ahead and go to 100%. Why not? My guys are mostly on the right of me. Okay, that's fine. I'm going to do a slow climb and turn to the right. I don't mean to undercut them. 
but I'm going to undercut them. I'm going to go back to gaining some altitude. Okay, so where we plan to go is Amens, which is that town over there. You can't see it because my wing struts are in the way. That's that's our target is Amens. So I'm continuing on with the climb and the right turn. Let my guys continue to uh, form with me. Now I'm going to throttle down just a little bit so that my team can catch up to me. I'm going to go level flight and I'll see you when we get closer to the objective. Alright guys, we are flying over on men's right here. We're slowly starting to turn towards the Villers. Uh, if you take a look at the map, we're right there. We're getting ready to turn over here. There's kind of like a little town over here. Let me see if I can show it. There it is. So we're going to be flying between this town and this river. And then once we get there, then we'll start turning over towards Dampierre. All right, and uh, once we get a little closer to Dom Pierre, or the the uh, the border, then I'll be right back. All right, see you then. All right, guys, now we are crossing over no man's land. We got our group together. I still don't know where my high cover is. Uh, they might have a different flight path than we do. Um, we're flying. I've noticed that there's a lot of ground fire down there. Um, so there's a there's a battle going on down there, uh, infantry battle. That's not us. So we are looking for either fighters or two seaters. Uh, once we get onto the far side of the no man's land, then we should turn and head north, which is this way. And uh, see where that town is right there. Uh, I think that's Albert, uh, and so we would fly pretty close to where Albert is and then turn around and go back and forth here. Maybe Combs, I don't know if I can see Combs. Albert for sure. Maybe that's Combs over there. Yeah, but we're not. It's a it's a pretty short patrol, but north and south. It's not uh, you know all the way up and down the border. It's just a few miles up and down. Okay, so what I'm doing now is keep my eyes open for the enemy, and as soon as I see the enemy, we'll be right back. Alright guys, so we have turned north on the far side, uh, going up towards Colmes, I think is what it's called. But if you can see this on the map or on the screen, you might not be able to see that, but there's about seven planes. Uh, some are, a, oh, maybe more than that. Um... Yeah, when you zoom in like that, you can't see them. But they're going right across that cloud there. There's like three or four. And then there's like three over on top of that cloud real high. So maybe we can intercept them because we're kind of traveling in a way towards that town there. 
but let me look around just to make sure I'm not missing something. I see something right between those four groups of woods in that field. Looks like something circling. Two, three, four planes. Yeah, we're going down. Yeah, where are these parachutes come from? Not allies, that's for sure. We don't carry parachutes. There's an enemy. Alright, so let's get on this guy. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Let's test fire. Don't hit me. Got him. Yep, got him. All right, now is there more than just one? Yes, possibly. I'm at full throttle.
I don't think that's an albatross because it looks too big to be an albatross. Looks like maybe a two seater. Okay, there might be a tail feather. Come on, get some good, good bullet fire. Here we go. Got him. Oh no! Albertstadt. Okay, I have a feeling there's more than one. What's going on over there? That's an ally. That's an ally. Are they just trying to form up on me? No, I don't think so. Maybe they are. That doesn't look like an, an ally. Ooh, that looks like a triplane. And that looks like a whatever that is. <laughs> Two-seater, possibly. Could be an albatross. I think he's going in. Patrol objective has been achieved. That's good. Guess what? Are they all low or is that just shadows? Where'd that triplane go? And is that my engine? Engine damage. Uh oh. Can you hear my my engine tinging? Like I've got no oil. Going ting 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 ting. You hear that? Or there's a bullet in one of the carburetors banging around. Maybe I need to get on the other side of the battlefield. That's where I'm heading. They nurse it. I don't see anybody coming after me. Oh, what's this? Wait, I can't lean out and look. Okay, good. Move with me. I'm going to try to climb a little bit, but my engine, oh my engine, okay, we're near the river, right, okay, so we're probably down here somewhere, uh, maybe that's the closest airfield, but I'm going to shoot for this one.
Let's see if I can survive with like 80% uh, throttle. All right, guys, so um, I'm going to leave you here and see if I can't nurse it closer to home. And if I can, oh, wait, there's, there's it. Something was going on over there. Got to get involved. Here we go. <laughs> what? That's probably ground fire anyway. I got a bullet coming through my windshield. Okay. Where was that tracer fire? I don't think I'm even going to make it. I shouldn't have turned around. I was going to come back and help. Oh, okay, who's this? Who's this? Is that an ally? It is. Hopefully he took care of the German. I'm going to try to climb and that if my engine cuts off I'm going to be able to glide further if I can get some altitude. Okay I'm back. I just wanted to let you know that I have all my controls. I have my rudder and I have my ailerons but I don't have my elevator. I do not, it's very minor, as you can see. I don't, I'm pulling and pushing and my elevator is not doing anything really. So landing might be a little tough. But I don't see why I couldn't make it. Even if the engine shuts off, I think I'm gonna be safe. Uh, I don't know where those two guys went. They broke off. So what I'm gonna do is, um, I'm gonna keep flying until we get closer to the airfield and then I'll be right back. All right, my engine cut off. So I guess we are going to be coasting now where is the closest airfield I might just be landing in a field uh, hard to tell there's down over there pillars right there I don't think okay the Billers airfield was probably right in that area I don't think I'll be able to get there so I'm looking for the best field land in this field right right here is probably a good one
underneath this balloon. There's artillery there too, so they, you know, they'll have trucks. <laughs> Wait, that's not the Villers over there, is it? <gasps> There's an airfield right there. Sounds like somebody's caught up to me. Yep. I'm going to give them hand and, up, hand and arm coordination here. Pilot district, flight leader, uh, orders. I'm going to say return to base. F7 never works. F4, just cover me. I'm not going to make it that far. First engine stop. First engine start. Yeah, it's not going to start. Whoops, hold on. Tell them to leave me alone. Okay, where, where, oh, where? I don't want to hit those trees, so. don't really want to hit this rough ground right there, you know, it looks like there's a big bump. But I'm almost to the airfield, man. I almost made it. If I didn't turn around to go help that guy, I would have made it. We are just coasting it in. I think we'll be all right. <laughs> I'm gonna flare as soon as we get close. Like right now might be good, good time to flare. Come on, flare it up. Flare, flare, flare. about and I'm on a road <laughs> somebody should be able to come by and pick me up and my flight should know where I landed because they were with me or at least two of them okay well let's see how we did let's get out of this mission and see how we did Alright, so here's the events log. We took off. We flew over here to Almens. We flew over here. Flew over there. Come on, drag it over. And we went up here, and on the way back, we encountered something. Is blue sub with camel down? By enemy spanned out machine guns. Okay. Flack got him. But what did we shoot down? Halber shot? Okay. If it's got a blue circle around it, it means I did it? Is that what I'm understanding? It is? Okay. I got a false. I got a halber stat. And I got a halber stat. Our team... Got a Halberstadt. A 
faults of faults in a Fokker DR1. Anything else? No. SC5A destroyed. Okay. Well, do I really need to know that? By DR1? And then... I was destroyed by an enemy Halberstadt? Okay. Yeah. Alright guys, so the next time we come back and play, we're going to be bombing a bridge, possibly? Bridge bombing. Alright, I'll see you in the next one.